This is probably the simplest way to create a snowball depth spreadsheet. Hi, welcome to day 19 of 30 day study spreadsheets. Took over a week to build it and simplify it to make this super beginner friendly. So get ready and let's get started. In cell B7, enter the table headers below. This will be the place we track all the loans and creditors. Format the table by using a darker color for the header. Then start entering all your creditors info such as name, balance, minimum payment, interest rate, and status. Before I forget, select the interest rate and format it as percentage. Let's also add a simple drop down for status. Once you open the data validation window, add the values, select from the preset colors, or click customize and use the eyedropper to select a color. Now add the second value. Customize the color for this value, click OK and done. Now you can select your status without typing it. Moving on, enter the formula rank.eq. This formula can be used to derive the ranking. Enter parentheses, select the balance on the same row, enter comma, then select the entire column for the balance. Use F4 key to lock the cell reference, enter comma, enter true, then hit enter. Now drag it down to all 5 rows. If you see the error, it was due to the empty value on row 4 and 5. So if you fill that up, it will solve the issue. But I highly recommend using if error to handle this. Again, drag it down to apply the updated formula. Now let's do something simpler, adding a title for this tracker. Then we move on to a mini form to collect the date, start date, and also the monthly payment for all the loans. To finish it off, let's hide the grid lines and see what we have created today. If you like this, follow for part two.